There it is. All you need, if you have it, and you looks like you got it, is a light pair, light to medium pair of dumbbells and a medicine ball. If it's a medicine ball, you can slam even better. If you don't have any of that stuff, if you haven't followed along on Facebook and on Zoom, you don't have that stuff, that's fine. You just get substitutions around the house. It really doesn't matter. So, why are we cut off here? All right, so we're gonna warm up. It's gonna be lots of footwork, lots of shuffling across the floor, around the room. If for some reason you can't shuffle across the floor, just admitting people into the room. If for some reason you can't shuffle across the floor, just make it a, a, a side step to the side, or you can just make even a forward jog and just stop. You're gonna be doing shuffling and moving across the floor this entire time. So there's gonna be tons of lateral shuffling. If for whatever reason your feet are cramped up or you know you can't do that stuff, make again, make it just a side step across the floor, or you can eat, literally just walk across the floor or just make a light jog across the floor. So whatever amount of space you have, you want as long of a space you can get because there's gonna be tons of shuffling. And we're gonna even start the shuffling off right off the bat from the warm up, from the warm up spot. So get yourself clear, make sure your space is clear, get yourself a light medicine ball and a light to medium pair of dumbbells. So find your spot, make sure you got room. If it's a short distance, that's fine. That just means you're gonna get more reps of the exercise. Long distance, that just means you're gonna get longer time on your feet and a little bit less reps to exercise. So it really doesn't matter. Some of them, if you have a lot of space, you might even intentionally cut it short to get more reps in. All right, so we're gonna warm up right off the bat in that space. You don't need any equipment for the warm up. First, give me a thumbs up, you hear me clear. You hear me clear? All right, awesome. So let's start with a shuffle. All we're gonna do is shuffle across the floor. When you get all the way on your left side, you're gonna stretch your left quad and then your right quad. Then shuffle all the way to the right side. Right quad, left quad. Hold it for one to three seconds. I'm trying to stay on the camera. I'm trying to get as long of a shuffle as possible when I'm still staying on the camera. So you shuffle to the left. Get left quad stretch, right quad stretch. Shuffle across to the right. On the right side first, hold it a little longer if you need to. You don't rush it. You need to hold it a little longer, one to three seconds, whenever you need to. Line across and shuffle across the floor. Left quad stretch, right quad. We're gonna take our time with these shuffles with this warm up because there's tons and tons of rounds we're gonna get. Your legs will need breaks to stretch in between. This is gonna be non stop shuffling. Stretch those quads and quad. Glide across the floor. Now let's go with shoulder stretch. So at the end, fling your chest open, stretch your right, bend your left, that's on the right side. Shuffle across to the left. Fling it open, stretch your left, then stretch your right. So the direction you're going to, you're gonna stretch that side first. Just glide across, fling it, stretch and hold. Fling it, stretch and hold the other side. Glide it across, fling, hold. So whatever direction you go to, you're gonna stretch that side first. Let's do it. Facebook, there'll be questions. We need help with anything, fling it. Stretch right and stretch left. Glide across, open it up, stretch left and right. You're just jumping in now on Facebook. All you need is a light pair of dumbbells and a light medicine ball. If you don't have that, just find anything around the house that has a little weight to it. It doesn't matter. You don't need any equipment. And you just need a little space like we're doing right here to shuffle across the floor. All right, we're going to go to knee hug. Knee hug right, knee hug left. We're just, just getting warmed up. Shuffle across on the left side, your knee hug left first, and then knee hug right. Line across. Whatever direction you go to, we're shuffling or stretching on that side first. Take your time on those stretches, don't rush them. Line across, left knee, right knee. Shuffle it, glide, stretch, boom, slip across. Get that knee up to your chest. Hold it a little longer, you can hold it anywhere from one to three seconds on that stretch. When you're shuffling across the floor, look at my feet, you're staying apart the entire time. So don't let your feet come close together and touch. Keep shuffling across. All right, let's go now to a tricep stretch. So across, you're gonna do a low chest fling, low fling down here and stretch your right tricep up. Low fling and stretch left tricep up. Shuffle across to the left side, you're gonna go left side first. Low fling, stretch left, low, Stretch right, go 
Sliding across the floor. Getting it rolling. Fling it. Stretch right tricep. So you're coming down at like a real deep angle down your side. Nice step. You're just flinging it open. So you're getting that chest and shoulder stretch out. And glide across the floor. Stretch left. And stretch right. Freaks on Facebook. Follow along. On Facebook, put a comment there if you're following along live. Where you're following from. And put replay if you're doing this workout on replay. Put a comment down below. Bling it one more time on the tricep on each side. And let's hit the other side over here. So get as much distance as you can. You can shuffle across the floor in your house, your backyard, wherever you are. In the bathroom, in the elevator, in the hotel room, whatever you got to do, it doesn't matter. All right, we're going to continue this shuffling, except now we're going to go across and you're going to stretch your hamstring. We lean forward. Front leg is straight, back leg is bent. Bring that chest open to the side, get the other side hamstring, and then shuffle across. So you're doing left, hamstring on the left, and then right. Shuffle across to your right side, and you'll do the right side first. Swing it, and breathe. Glide across. Hamstring stretch, bring that chest open. Take a good amount of time to warm up. We need your entire body warmed up. All the muscles, upper body, lower body, calves, feet, core. Everything warmed up. You need a little sweat going, blood flowing, your heart rate up a little bit. And time, just shake it out. Look right, look over here. If you can see over here, I'm going to stretch. My calves. So find a spot you're against a wall or a dumbbell because you're going to want to do this on any break, any chance you can't stay. So put your foot up high against the wall or high against the step and lean your body forward into it with this leg straight. My right foot is, is up high, my toes up high, up against the wall and lean forward into it with the right leg staying straight. Now keep that right leg on the step, but step away from the left. And now bend the right knee forward so you get the lower part of the calves. So while that right leg is against the step, now bend the knee and push forward to get the lower part of the calves and the Achilles. So first, you kept the right leg straight, and then you bent it. And switch over to the other side. This should be a real tight stretch. If you get those toes elevated up against the wall, lean in with that leg straight first on the left side. After you stretch out for a few seconds, bend the left knee and push forward with the toes. To get the lower part of the calves, because there's going to be tons of suffering. You're doing it with holding the weights, do it with exercises. So you're going to need to try to stretch your feet and calves. The best way is to press them up against something. Even putting them on like if you have a dumbbell, like if you look here, a dumbbell on the floor, you can put your foot up on the dumbbell and just bend this knee forward. So I'm stretching the forward leg. You're probably seeing the one where you're on a wall and you're stretching the back leg. You're stretching the back leg. We're not doing that. You're stretching the foot that's up against the wall. You can put it up on a wall on the edge of a dumbbell, whatever works. All right, let's get into the first round. We're gonna ease into this first round. It's gonna be just body weight. You don't need any equipment for it. You're gonna glide across the floor. All we're gonna hit is two jacks, two dummy Jack. Jim across. Boom. Boom. Glide, glide. This is fast. This is cardio. Pop it out. I'm trying to stay on the edge of the screen. I'm trying to get maximum distance on my shuffle. Shuffle across. Just two jacks. Light and smooth. Just getting the blood flowing. It's going to be long rounds. Keep it moving. And listen, keep it safe on your shuffle. If you know you can't shuffle, just do a slow walk, lateral walk across the floor. Do what you got to do. Keep it rolling. Keep it moving. Steve Crawl is on there from Scranton, Pennsylvania, following along live from Pennsylvania. Two jacks at each end of your shuffle. Hop, hop, right at your feet. Glide across. 
it's going to be very long rounds with no real break in between seconds of the round. It's going to be just a second to catch the breath, to shake it, and then on to the next exercise. Two jacks. We are just getting it rolling. Wide across. Pop. Pop. Time. All right, same thing. We're staying on the same round. You're going to wait. This is going to be split jacks. Legs only, so it's just front to back jack. You see, lay on my feet right there, just for four. Four total to each side. So just shuffle across. Two, three, four. Four split jacks. Glide across. Light on your feet. Just bounce it across. There we go. You know you can't shuffle, just modify it. If you can't bounce, the modification is just to step back one leg at a time. Just look at my feet there, just stepping back. One leg at a time. If you can't do the jumps, there is always a modification for everything. There is always no excuse for anything. You can always figure it out, make it way, make it work. Light on your feet, go out across. Your heart rate should be getting up. Your body temperature should be getting up. Getting ready to move, getting ready to work. Go out across. They shouldn't need. You're slightly bent when you're doing that shuffle. Your ankle, your knee, and your hip all slightly bent. Strong athletic stance on that shuffle. Glide across. Hop, 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 hop. Zip it. One, two, three, four. A couple more times. Oh, yeah, those legs have the feeling it already. You are screwed. Because this is just literally the second segment of about 99 segments. I'm not even joking. We're going to squeeze anything and get in. But there's about three hours worth of work. We're going to try and cram in in this next hour and a half. Now we're going to be here together. Pop, pop, pop. pop. We're getting all nervous for you for an hour and a half, Tyson. Huh? Why are you nervous? You thought it was an hour? Oh, you're screwed, sucker. Time. Shake it. Listen, this half a second you get in between, keep stretching, keep shaking. Find those calf stretches because we are just getting started. Stretch them, stretch them, shake it, stretch your quads, your glutes, hamstrings, all those stretches we did in the beginning. Because we are just getting started. Your legs are going to be toasted. They're going to be fried. All right, we're on each end. You're going to do one squat thrust. And I bet you never thought you'd be excited for a freaking squat thrust, but you're going to be because what that's going to do is give you a freaking break from this damn shuffle that we're going to be doing for like 48 of the 60 minutes that we're here. I mean, 90 minutes. My bad. All right. Let's do it. So one squat thrust each end. That's it. So glide across the floor. Squat down. Jump back. Jump in. And glide across. That squat thrust is literally a break for you because it's a break from this shuffle. Which I bet you never realized that a shuffle will wear your ass down so fast. I thought my legs were feeling either way. And my legs were already sore. They've been permanently sore since about 15. Since that whole Corona shut down both squares to start. Literally, I have only taken, how many days have I taken off since then, Tyson? At least seven. So we've taken only six or seven days off since March 16. So we have one day off a month of training. And look, we're still alive. Still kicking. Amazing. And we're talking about working out. We're talking about training. We're not talking about exercise. And so, uh, we're in fairly decent shape, and this shuffling is already wearing down my freaking legs. So listen, if you have to, what you do is stop and look. Just walk it across the floor. That's fine. Or just do a forward across the floor if you have to. If you need to, just walk across the floor and then stop and do your exercise. Or no walk, just do the exercise. Look at the walk you need. You can still speed walk across the floor. Turn. Pop for your exercise. Jog across the floor. Pop for the exercise. Then go back to a shuffle. After you gave a little bit of pop. Shuffle to the left. Pop on the side. Oh yeah, go back to your jog if you have to. Squat thrust. Jog the other way. Squat thrust. And then walk so you can recover all of them ready. So it's still working. There's always a modification. Modify before you stop. Die before you fucking quit. Time. Shake it, shake it, shake it. 
shake it. Got some more of their hydrate. Keep those legs stressed out. Active recovery. Stretch those shoulders. Keep stretching those calves. So you don't, you don't have to go over the wall. You can keep a dumbbell somewhere out of the way and have it trip on. So you can be stretching those calves. The toes bent, the feet bent, with the knee bent, but also with it straight. Stay hydrated, sip some water. All right, let's do it. One crawl out each end of the shuffle. All you gotta do is one crawl out. Let's roll. So crawl up wider space and shoulder width, squat down, crawl out to push up position, crawl back in and get on your horse. Let's do it. Boom, let's begin. One crawl out and shuffle. So now that takes even longer than the squat thrust. This is giving, I mean, yeah, this is giving that shuffle an even longer break. But don't worry. Some exercises after this are going to give you even a shorter break. And it's going to be faster pace your legs. So there's plenty of suckery still ahead. Don't worry. Plenty of freaking suckery on the way. I'm going to hook you up. Crawl it out. We'll push up position. Zip it across. Uh, 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 uh. If you're feeling crazy and you want a longer break, you can shuffle, add a push up in down there. Call it out. Get that upper body working. There is a round coming up that's going to have a ton of upper body, so don't worry. If you want to get it warmed up now, add in that one push up after the crawl out. And then glide across. Crawl out. Push up if you want. Pull in. And giddy up. On your horse. On the move, attack. Attack every freaking set. Bring the freaking fire every second of every freaking Everything you do in life, you see it. No matter how simple it seems, make it hard, make it intense. You're sweeping the floor. Sweep the floor like a motherfucker. Get the mail like a madman. All out in everything you do. Come on, shake it, shake it, shake it. We are just getting started. How we feel? Are we good? Yeah. Edu. Yosef, we good? You're sure, Edu? Slumping over. We are just getting up. We have dozens of segments left. Just shake it. Stay active. Stretch those shoulders. Facebook freaks, put a comment down below if you are following along and where you are following from. What's up? Shake it. Stretch it. All right. So this one's going to kind of suck. So it's coming after. It's just high knees. It's high knees you've done all the time. Pretty easy in general, right? But right after a shuffle, to have to go four high knees right back to a shuffle. So listen, the faster pace you go, the shorter amount of time we'll have to do this shit. So it's just four high knees each end of your shuffle. So the legs get no freaking break. Because they got plenty of break those last two rounds. Let's do it in three, two, one, boom. Fly across, hop, 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 hop. Shuffle, high knee, hop, 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 hop. Shuffle across, listen, you need to modify, you just march in place. Or just do a jog in place if you have to. There's always a way to make it happen. Hop, 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 hop. Turn into the room. Keep it rolling. Zip it across. Hop, 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 hop. Across. You have to just jog in place before. Zip. Dig it, dig it, dig it. Line across. Four high knees in place on the end of your shuffle. Zip it. Boom, 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 boom. Glide, glide. And light on your feet with the shuffle. Ha, 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 ha. Turn that to the screen. But I'm getting too excited with the shuffle. Then I can't even stop and go through a freaking wall. Ha, ha, ha. There it is. Glide. Boom, 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 boom. Zip. Come on, come on. Faster pace. Let's go, freak. Pick it up. 
fast you go. The less time we have to do it. Keep going. Ah, 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 ah. Boom, 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 boom. Time. Shake it, shake it, shake it. Stretch those legs. Your heart rate should be through the roof right now. If you were pushing the pace the way that you should be, your heart rate should be through the roof. Your legs should be fried. Keep on stretching them with these couple seconds you have while I'm battling. Because that's the only breaks you're getting. Is the battle breaks. All you get are breaks. All right. So now we have four mountain climbers each end of your shuffle. So it's still fast paced. But at least the up and down, believe it or not, is going to actually save your ass getting up and down just to get into that position and out of the position. Because anything you're going to do, anything you can get a break from the fast pace and the shuffle is going to help you out. All right, four mountain climbers, each end of the shuffle. Get down there quickly, safely. Make it kind of a spot for us to get down there if you can. We're going in three, in two, in one. Glide across, mountain climbers. Four, each end. One, two, three, four. And zip right to your shuffle. I want to speed, fast finger pace, hop, 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 and glide. Bury yourself. You should be 10 seconds into this set, and you sure you be like, holy shit, I'm going to die. Holy shit, I am never going to make it through this whole two minutes of this set. But you know what? We're going to get to the next rep, and you're going to go one step at a time. One step at a time, and you're going to freaking survive. And you're gonna make it happen. Glide across. Tyson, you're a little sick. Because you're a midget. I'm trying to keep up with you, but you got the little midget leg. I'm gonna die trying to keep up with you. Well, you don't get sloppy with your stuff. Glide across. Get down with some speed. So, whoa. Come right into the shuffle. Push the damn pace, freaks. Goes back flat. Time! Yes. Yes, we are rolling. We are rolling. Shake it. Stretch it. Breathe it out. Keep moving. Keep moving. All right. All it's going to be here is two front kicks on each end of your shuffle. A little slower. If you want to real fast pace in a row, so you want to be able to keep going without having to take a real break. So when you get to the left side, it's just left front kick. Right front kick, you shuffle across to the right, right, left. That's how you go to, you're kicking with that first. Let's do it. Going in three, two, one, shuffle. Left, right, on the left, and over to the right side. Left, glide, boom, boom. Oh, if I catch you, Tice, I'm gonna be behind you. You're gonna get a boot, yes, I'm coming. Whoa! Come on, you better move faster. Oh, I want to come with your head. I want to kick your ear off. Bam! Bam! Glide! Ha! Ha! Breathe it out. Whip it across. Turn this other camera on just so we have multiple angles. There we go. You can see the ass kickery from multiple. Cross, boom, boom, ooh, some sweet chin for you, boom, slide, boom, boom, zip, zip, this is an easy round here, we can consider this a recovery round pretty much, ah, shake it, stretch it, we're going right to it in a second, all we're doing is two plank jacks coming up. Jacks on each. You're just jumping apart and together. Two plank jacks, each end of your shuffle. I'm gonna move this dumbbell because I was busting my ass on one of those. Trying to keep up with Tyson. I was like whack, wiggling side to side. Not even a straight line. Trying to keep up with you. I'm like wobbling around like I'm freaking drunk. All right, let's do it. Two squat. Two plank jacks, each end of the shuffle. Go. Three, two, one, rolling. So squat thrust down. Two, and squat thrust back up. Line across, squat thrust down. Two, squat thrust down. 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 Squat thrust
squat down, jump back, and apart together, apart together, jump forward, squat up, Roman, two, just two jacks, that's it. So it's basically a squat thrust to two plank jacks. Forward and come up. Oh yeah, squat down. Oh, oh. Five. Zipping. What the heck? See her work out? See she work. Writing is insane. So they're gonna disappear. Right across. Hop, hop, oh. Squat and shuffle. Keep rolling. Push the pace. Bear yourself. Wear yourself out. See what you're here for. This is your time. Your time. This is your you time. Your selfish time. This ain't social hour. This ain't happy hour. This ain't chit chat freaking hour. This ain't giving around hugs and kisses. Go to little friends hour. It's a work hour. That's what it is. Time to put out. Time to not make any excuses. Time to put yourself first. For the first time in a long time. the first time ever. Your time. Time. Got me all hyped up. Battling during that round. It was like forever. Stretch those legs. It's coming up. You got two squat jumps on each end of your shuffle. It's going to suck. Stretch those legs. Keep stretching. Keep shaking. Long way to go. We're not even halfway to the halfway mark. Figure out. Shake it. Stretch it. All right. Two squat jumps. Slide across the floor. 23, 2, 1, go. Zip. Squat. Get some air. Let's see it. Ah, ah. Oh, yeah. Ah. Cross. Get up there. Get some air. Get some air. We used to be able to make jokes. Tyson and mine's jumping ability, or lack of it. We used to be able to make jokes about that. But nowadays, nowadays, you can't make those jokes. There's too many people. You get butt hurt about it. Right across. Ah. Ah. Get some air. Fry your legs. Fry them. Your quads should be burning. They should be frying. You should be able to cook freaking some nasty ass bacon on your quads right now because they should be on fire. They should be like a frying pan. Get up there. Now get up. Oh yeah. Zip. Zip across. We're gonna burn your legs out. Because well, I'm not afraid. Just time to get your dumbbells set up. Hydrate. So we're gonna burn these legs out before we get going to dumbbells. So this is just the first group that we're completing right now out of six groups. And this is the shortest group in the hall that we're on right now. Oh yeah. Time! Fuck yeah! Legs are feeling good. Preston Fontanet can can we do boxing? You can do you can box on the end of these shuffles. But Thursday night, 615 Eastern, 315 Pacific time. Free full boxing session, full hour of boxing every week on Facebook. But right now, you should be hitting these exercises. Shake it, stretch it. Get yourself your dumbbells out. You don't need crazy heavy dumbbells. Like, I'm literally just going to use 20 pound dumbbells. You don't need heavy dumbbells. Same game. We're going to shuffle right now. 
what you're gonna be doing when we shuffle is holding these dumbbells at your shoulders. When we get to the ends, it'll be a different exercise on each end. I'll call it out as we're going. I'll let you know. It's gonna start off with just all shoulder presses on each end. So pumps, you're holding them here. Get to the end, it's just four alternate shoulder press. Shuffle across, four alternate shoulder press on the other end. Do that last stretch on your legs. Scoop up those dumbbells. Get them on your shoulders, shoulder back position right here. Glide across, a little slower if you have to. Get on the end, plant your feet. One, two, three, four. Shuffle across. Four presses on this side. Ha, 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 ha. Oh, yeah. Cross. One, two, three, four. Glide. Abs tight while you move with this weight. You feel like it's too much impact, just do a side step to get across here. Whatever works. Boom, 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 boom. Four presses. Zip across. Abs are strong. Back is straight. Go arch your back and push it overhead. There we go. Keep those weights to the shoulder rack again. You do when you're moving. Keep that shoulder rack. Fight for it. You'll get to put them down in between sets. So we're trying to hold out. You need to adjust your weight, adjust your weight. You feel like your technique is off or it's too heavy. Zip. Across. Pop, 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 pop. Glide. Oh, yeah. Boom, 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 boom. Time. Down, sit those arms down, your shoulders break for a second. All that's going to be here is two squats each end of your shuffle. So you're holding the weights here as you shuffle across. Don't rush the squat. Two squats. Also, take your time on your stairs because you have extra weight. You don't want to be pounding on your joints. So take your time to get across. Two slow, controlled squats on each end. It's the dumbbell round. It's going to be a little slower pace. Should not be that easy. That was the last round, the bodyweight round. Let's do it. Scoop them up. Shoulder rack. Shuffle across. Two butts. Glide across. You don't need crazy heavy weights. Full deep squats. Glide. Oh, yeah. Even though it's a squat. Trying just hold the waist in position there. You're not resting on your shoulders. God. Do what you gotta do. You gotta put the reset. Recover and get back to it. Oh yeah. Two. Sit across. Sit back in the hip spot. Out to the mouth, up. Time. Shake it, shake it, shake it. We're going to be with these dumbbells for a while here. We're going four alternating curls each end of the shuffle. So you're going to hold them here at the shoulder rack where your biceps and forearms are prying. Hop in for four curls. Get them both back to that shoulder rack. We good? We feel good? We awake yet? We warmed up yet? Oh yeah. Let's do it. Four alternating curls. The rack. And four curls. I don't care if the palms are up or in on these, whatever works. Don't hold them. Palms up as long as your elbows are at your side. Zip it across. Glide. Oh, yeah. One, two, three, four. Zip it. Your arms should be done already. They should be freaking done. Who's that that just jumped in that camera? You better give that girl some dumbbells and get her shuffling. Whoever just jumped on the camera, better get her a pair of dumbbells. You got space there for two of you to shuffle. Oh, shit, your arms are on fire. Oh, yeah. Ha, 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 ha. Woo. Get pumped. 
Pumped up. Pumped up. Shake it. Stretch your shoulders out. Keep rotating them. Keeping them moving. Get ready for the next round, next set. This next set is going to be just one squat to press on each end. Just one. So you're holding that shoulder rack. It's going to stop holding them there. Coming squat, press, back shoulder rack, and shuffle it across. Stretch those shoulders. Stretch those arms. Ready to rock. Going in three, two, one. Shoulder rack, shuffle. Full squat, press, shuffle. Just one squat to press, each end. Hell yeah, feeling good. Whole body's getting fried now. Total body movement. We're working the upper, the lower, the core, the cardio, the coordination. Breathe out as you shoot that up there. Into your nose on the way down, out of your mouth on the way up. Hell yeah. Drive it. Boom. Zip. Across. Full squat. And press. Your arms should be shot. Already, we're going to get two more. One more. Day. Suck it up. We're good. Did an excellent accent. Squat. Boom. Time. Woo. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Arms should be pumped up by now. You should be dripping sweat. Shake that. Stretch that. There's arms ready. Hardest round on the upper body. So dumbbell group. So that's how it's supposed to feel. Your arms should feel that way. And now you forgot how much the shuffle sucked. All right, we're going to go curl to press. Just one each arm. So you're going to hold them at the shoulder rack. When you get to the right, you go right arm, curl to press, left arm, and get them both back to the shoulder rack for the shuffle. Whatever side you're going to, that arm is going to go first. Let's do it. Scoop them up. Yeah, it's time. Even though your arm is still zapped, try, toasted, shuffle it across. So right arm. Curl the press, back to shoulder, left arm. Curl the press, shoulder, and shuffle. On the left side, left arm goes first. Curl, press, shoulder rack. Curl, press, shoulder rack, and shuffle. So whatever direction you're shuffling to, that arm is gonna go first. Boom. Make sure the lower back doesn't arch as you're pushing overhead. Throw it up there. Get those knees slightly back. Place, make sure you're not locking those knees out. Ha! Oh, yeah, those shoulders are done. The grip is done. The biceps are done. The forearms are done. Oh, shit. Because the set is not done. Just deal with it. One at a time. One movement at a time. Come on, one more time. Let's get strong. Boom. Oh yeah. Ah. One more on the other side. One more on the other side. Boom. Time. Shake it. The dumbbells. Dumbbells are not done. This main camera seems like it's chopping. It seems like crappy quality. I'm gonna switch. and then put it back on. Oh, there we go. All right, we're back on both. Yep, all good. All right, so dumbbells. Now we're going to squat to curl, double arm. Squat, curl on one rep on each side. So go inside the legs, please. Have a pretty good, strong shoulder width stance for the squat. 
One squat to curl on each end. Let's do it. Get them up. Shoulder rack position. Shuffle across. Squat. Just want to do a hammer curl. Keep the palms in the whole time. It's going to be easier to transition. So get it in between your legs. Zip across. Yes. Five. Squat and curl. Keep that head up. Chest out. Shoulders back and down like that squat. Don't let that weight pull you forward. Upper body straight up and down. Breathe out. In through the nose down. Out the mouth up. Exhale as you drive it up. Flat across. Ha. Boom. Zip. Zip. Oh, yeah. It sucks on the arms right now. It sucks. Massive levels of suckery, but we freaking love it. We wouldn't have it any other way. This is what we're here for, to suffer. Because listen, no levels of success or achievement or high performance or weight loss or muscle building or making money, no level of success in any of those areas is possible without some pain, without some sacrifice, and without some freaking suffering. You need to suffer to get the transformation. Squat, curl, time. We got a couple more of the dumbbells. So we have, coming up, one dumbbell squat thrust on each end. It's gonna suck, but it's gonna be kind of good to use the arms to break. That push-up position is actually gonna be an easier position to hold the damn weights up at this point. So again, the dumbbell squat thrust is my gift to you to give you that break. You know, it's a fucked up round when a dumbbell squat thrust is your easy part, is your rest portion of the round. Keep those forearms, stretch those forearms out because your grip is going to start fading. Rotate your wrists, smack your freaking forearms, shake them, get the blood flowing, get those shoulders, get those shoulders loose, stretch those quads. We're all sitting here smacking our forearms like we're a bunch of crackheads. We're never going to do this. We're about to pump some heroin into our veins. All right. One dumbbell squat thrust. Each end of your shuffle. Scoop them up. Just hold them in the shoulder rack right the shuffle. Scoop them up. Shoulder rack. Right. Three, two, one, shuffle. Squat thrust. Ah, now, now, in up, curl them up to that shoulder rack. Oh, that sucks. That sucks. But it feels so good. Come on across. Squat down. Jump back. Jump in. Squat up. Curl them to get it back there. Stretch to get an extra bicep. Look at that. A bonus. A bonus. Curl them to the girls. Look at those arms up. Oh, shit. Yeah. Come on. Come across. Squat down. Jump back. Jump forward. Squat up. Zip. Oh, yeah. Good news is, we only got one step of the dumbbells left after this one. Your hands are soaking like mine. Literally, my palms are dripping and sweating this way as I slip down my freaking hands. It's like they're greased up. So you gotta grip it even tighter so that shit doesn't fly and break my damn tongue. Or fly and hit Tyson in the back of his dome. Oh, fuck. Yeah! Time! Woo! Hell yeah. If you're spinning, if you're dizzy, if you're nauseous, if you're not sure if you're going to keep your consciousness, you are in the right place. Enjoy your breathing. Keep it under control. All we got left for the dumbbell round is one crawl out on each end of the shoulder. <laughs> And the funniest part is, this is only the second group out of six. I wasn't even joking. I guess we're not getting all six groups in in an hour and a half from here. 
So we'll just have to continue that next time. This is some long rounds. All right, one crawl out each end. Shoulder rack, scoop them up. Let's roll, get them up, get them up. Let's break tuck, wide across. One crawl, wide stance, wide the shoulder width. Roll all the way out to the push-up position. Don't slide the weights. And a push-up, just for the sheer of it. Wide across, wide stance, wide the shoulder width. Squat down, don't slide the weights. Walk them out, clunk them out there. Full push-up position. One push up, crawl them back, curl them up to the shoulder rack, and shuffle. Holy shit, that's a lot of work. <laughs> Who the hell's idea was this shit? Come up and zip. Do you know where you are? I don't see you. You disappeared off camera. Jump. There you are. Just making sure you're still amongst the living. Oh yeah, walk them out there. Don't slide those weights. They're gonna want to slide. Take them up and place them on the freaking floor. Holy shit, this is some fun stuff. Fun stuff! And a push-up out there. Woo. Curl them up and glide. Give me one more. One more on each side. Hell yeah! Ah, hold on. Ah, one more on the last side. Shuffle it, zip it, crawl it, push it, crawl it, curl it, squat it, dump that shit on the freaking floor. Dumbbells are done. Shake it out. Time. Dumbbells are done. You can do the dumbbells. Away, get your medicine ball out. A dead weight medicine ball. Oh shit. Shake it. Set your shoulders. You need your dead weight med dead weight medicine ball. I'm using a 20. Use that works for you. Does not matter. Take a couple more seconds, just shake it out. Five days if you need to. We're going right back to that shuffle. It's going to be fast paced. We're going to have those dumbbells weighing us down. It's like one little medicine ball that we're going to be doing fast paced exercise with. You should be dripping sweat. You're sweating like a pig. <laughs> All right, we're going to start literally just one regular slam on each end. So a full slam, and it's dead weight. You need to drop down with it, or it's popping right back into your hands into a deep squat. So you're not slamming it and then leaning over to go get it. You're dropping with it as you freaking slam. All right, let's do it. Hold the ball while you're holding it at your chest. Chest position, one slam, go. Chest, shuffle across. Ah. Slide across. Boom! Big slam, massive slam. I want to hold it around. It should look like there's a water shell. It's just dropping freaking rainmakers down on the ground. Slam across. Boom! Oh, yeah! Ha! Intensity every second. Boom! Oh, keep those abs tight. Don't forget, every exercise is an ab exercise. Keep those abs tight. Every second of every set. Boom! Mm. Catch it. Ha! Woo! Yeah! Boom! Holy shit. Ah, shake it. 
Bye. We have two. I said two and I'm holding up one finger. I'm losing it. I'm losing it. That's how you know you're getting the right effect. Two. Jack press up on each end. Shuffle it across. Holding it at your chest. Two jack press up. Each end of your shuffle. Big deep breaths. Let's do it. Go three, two, one. Let's do it. Shuffle. Jack press up for two. Hold it at your chest. Glide across. Ha. Ha. Fully extend those arms overhead. So the weight goes up. When the feet go apart, back to your chest with feet come together. Up and apart, down and together. Ha. Up and apart, down together for two. Two jack press up. Each end of your shots. Oh yeah. Ha. Ha. Glide across. Control that weight. Your arms are going to start feeling it. Just some hold up all the chest. After all those dumbbell rounds, work through it. Do what you gotta do with this and turn it into a walk if you have to. Then you two jack press. You have to modify the jack press. Just tap one foot out at a time if you have to. You wanna jog across the floor. Jog across the floor. Do what you've got to do. Ha. Ha. Two more. One more time. Boom. Boom. Last one on the far side. Ha. 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 Woo. Oh yeah, Yosef has a partner. There it is. His head, his medicine ball is heavier than yours. Nice. Shake him out. So we're gonna go with a jumping slam on each end of your shuffle. So you shuffle across. It's at your chest. You're gonna push up while you're in the air and boom. So it's gonna be even. Harder on your legs. You're welcome. Stretch those legs. You're ready to go. This is sucking right now. It's supposed to suck. If it was easy, everyone would be walking around healthy and in shape and with strong immune systems, having all those nasty viruses and toothpastes, all that shit just bouncing off of them. This stuff is supposed to be easy. It's not supposed to be easy. All right, let's do it. One jump slam. Each end. I said one or two. One. Your hair is so wet, it's always something out your head now. Go on his hair. Let's do it. One jump slam. Chest. Chest rack. Go. Shuffle. Jump. Oh, yeah. Get some air. Oh, yes. One jump slam. Bend first before you jump. Now look, you're shuffling. Get to the end. Little wind up and boom. Oh, that sucks. That is pure suckness. Ah, boom. Why? With some psychopath put this at the end of the workout. You gotta be sick in the head. Hell yeah. Who would have it? Any other. No way that this bastard changed the thing up. Fuck your ass. The towel knocked down. The same thing, you're exactly just got smushed. Jump! Slam! Come on, big slam. Big slam breaks. Jump! Boom! One more inside! Suck it up! Ha! Land smooth. Land on your feet. Low impact. Boom! Shake it! Oh yeah! Woo! Shake it out. Shake those legs. We have two. Jack, press, out. Coming up. So the ball goes away from your body as your feet come apart. Two jack, press, out. Oh yeah! Fun stuff. Stretch those legs. And let's get ready to roll. Two jack press out. Each end of the shuffle. Going in three, two, one. 
Shuffle! Push it forward, in front of you. Arms slowly extend, so beside you. Get on camera, boom, boom. So right at shoulder level, straight across. If it's too heavy, you can't jump, don't forget, just tap. One foot out at a time, while you're shuffling. Two, jack press out, zip across. Ha, ha, glide, glide, boom, boom. As tight as you push that ball away, you need that support of your core. Zip it across. Glide. Don't forget, you've had enough of the shuffle. Just jog across the floor and hit your exercises. Or fast walk across the floor and modify the jack press. Come on, one more side. One more side. That's it. That's it. Done! Ha! Ha! Time! And we are freaking done. You missed a high five, sucker. Good job. Peak Perry knuckle. <laughs> Fist bump as I choke on my own. Yeah. Spit and sweat. Nice work. Come up on the screen. And mute yourselves real quick, or unmute yourselves. Just a second workout of the day. You're killing it. Hi. Yeah. Hi. Did you do a whole workout with us? Yeah. Oh. Did you get a good exercise? Yeah. Okay. This nice is work. Sick workout too. Sick yeah. workout day. Freaks. So have oh. you, have you, any of you done, I think, Joseph, you told me you, you did the, that longer than the PFT, right? Yes, that was crazy. And you said you did halfway uphill or something? That's just not a bright move on your part. Yeah, halfway uphill is one thing. Finishing it uphill was not a bright move. Especially now that's my, my standard, so I gotta do that every time now, I guess, right? Yeah. Or find a flat ground and get a new time, because that's gonna suck every time. Yeah. What was your time? What was your total time? Um, I think about an hour with a 12 minute warm up. But without, after the warm up, an hour, right? Including, including the warm up. Oh, so we time it just from the run. So, so like 48, 48 minutes. The run was only 10 minutes each, nine minutes each, nine and, and 10, I think. And then, and then the, uh, what do you call it, was the, the, the middle was just cruel. Just so you know, this with some private groups of mine and some other groups I coach from around the world that we meet in person. And the record right now has me beat. beat it. My time is 33 minutes, and the record is 29 minutes right now. Okay. So I just see that. <laughs> okay. Give me a couple of years. Questions or need any help or anything on nutrition and workouts? I will talk to you later. Thanks. Oh, so thanks, guys. Speaking. Awesome. No excuses. Harry Knuckle Fist Bump, Instagram, Facebook. We are all done. See you later. Take care. Anything you want to say, little freak? Very, very normal child. I can't imagine where he gets it from. I will talk to you later. You are freaking awesome. No excuses. Crawl, I want to see some pictures and some video of you doing this workout over in Pennsylvania. I will talk to you later. If you have any questions, comments, need help with anything, put a message below. If you send me a private message. Let's talk about it. We will get you hooked up. Trying out these sessions for 21 days to $21. Completely unlimited. You can be on the live Facebook follow-alongs.